Aviation has a unique language designed to ensure effective communication between pilots and controllers. Let's take a look at some of the words and phrases you might encounter when operating on the surface of an airport or preparing to land from the flight deck. Skylane 7241 Romeo, ready at runway 14 right, departing southeast bound. Skylane 7241 Romeo, roger. Roger is not a clearance, and it is not an appropriate response to a yes or no question. It only means that I received your last transmission. You should never respond to an ATC clearance or instruction with Roger in lieu of a proper readback. Skylane 7241 Romeo ready for departure. Skylane 7241 Romeo standby. November 3, Niner Quebec, turn right on Alpha. Contact ground 121.7. Right on Alpha. Contact ground 121.7, November 3, Niner Quebec. If a controller responds to your transmission with standby, they are busy with a higher priority task. After the controller is ready to receive your request, they may say, Skylane 7241 Romeo, go ahead. Skylane 7241 Romeo, ready at runway 16 left. Skylane 7241 Romeo, runway 16 left, cleared for takeoff. Cleared for takeoff, runway 16 left, Skylane 7241 Romeo. Go ahead. It means to proceed with your message. It does not mean to go ahead and do what you are requesting to do. Skyline 41 Romeo, hold short runway 10 right. Holding short runway 10 right, Skyline 41 Romeo. Hold short. Hold short is one of the most important instructions in surface operations. When instructed to hold short of a runway, an ILS critical area, or the approach or departure area for a runway, you must stop prior to the hold short line so that no part of your aircraft is over the hold short line painted on the taxiway. Skylane 41 Romeo, monitor tower 124.6. Monitor tower 124.6, Skylane 41 Romeo. Monitor. If instructed to monitor a frequency, you should tune it in and wait for the controller to contact you. At some airports, ground control instructs pilots to monitor tower rather than contact tower. This does not mean you can depart as long as you monitor the tower frequency. Skylane 41 Romeo, taxi to the FBO via Bravo, monitor ground. Taxi to the FBO via Bravo, monitor ground, Skylane 41 Romeo. If tower gives you taxi instructions to parking and tells you to monitor ground, they are likely working both positions and want you on the ground frequency in case they need to contact you. Skylane 7241 Romeo, ready for departure. Skylane 7241 Romeo, taxi up to and hold short of runway 3 left. Taxiing to runway 3 left. Skylane 7241 Romeo. Skylane 41 Romeo, confirm you'll be holding short of runway 3 left. Taxi 2 and hold short of runway 3 left. Skylane 41 Romeo. Taxi up to and hold short of the runway. If you call the tower for departure at some distance from the hold line, such as a run-up area, the controller may say something like, taxi up to and hold short. They want you to move closer to the hold line to reduce the time it will take for you to taxi onto the runway when they clear you for takeoff. It does not mean to taxi up to the runway edge. Remember, taxi instructions to a runway always mean to the hold line, not the runway itself. Skylane 7241 Romeo, continue taxi. Continuing taxi, Skylane 41 Romeo. Continue. An instruction to continue is followed by what you are to continue doing. For example, if told to hold position while taxiing, the controller may instruct you to continue taxi. Remember, an instruction to continue does not by itself allow you to enter or cross a runway. You must receive a specific ATC clearance to enter or cross any runway, active or not. Skylane 7241 Romeo, runway 18 left, line up and wait. Line up and wait. Runway 18 left, Skylane 7241 Romeo. If instructed to line up and wait, you should taxi onto the runway and line up so you will be ready to depart when subsequently cleared for takeoff. You should query the controller if 90 seconds have passed since you were told to line up and wait and you haven't been cleared for takeoff. Note, controllers use line up and wait under a strict set of rules. Pilots operating at non-towered airports should never announce on CTAF they are going to line up and wait. 
Skylane 7241 Romeo, runway 3 left, cleared to land. When cleared to land, ATC expects you to land and turn off the runway. One issue that may occasionally occur is when a pilot calls the tower asking for touch and goes, but are subsequently cleared to land, most likely because the controller forgot. A quick Cessna 34 Alpha request touch and go will likely result in a clearance for a touch and go. However, doing a touch and go when cleared to land results in an unauthorized departure and possible pilot deviation. Skylane 7241 Romeo, runway 31 left, cleared low approach. When cleared for a low approach, you are expected to overfly the runway, but not touch down. Skylane 7241 Romeo, runway 3 left, cleared for the option. Cleared for the option. This is ATC authorization for you to make your choice of a touch and go, low approach, stop and go, or full stop landing. Skylane 7241 Romeo, unable stop and go, all other options approved. Means you can do any option except a stop and go. November 41 Romeo, go around. Go around means to immediately initiate a climb to pattern altitude while overflying the runway. If the controller says to go around left or right of runway, you should offset to the specified side to avoid overflying the runway. A note, if you are IFR and flying an instrument approach, you should execute the published missed approach procedure unless otherwise instructed. November 41 Romeo, continue. Traffic will be departing prior to your arrival. When approaching an airport, you might be told to continue because the controller can't issue a landing clearance, perhaps because an aircraft has been told to line up and wait on the runway. You are expected to continue inbound and await further instructions. Here are some key phrases for pilots. Skylane 7241 Romeo, request progressive taxi. If you are unsure about being able to execute the taxi instructions given by ATC, you can say, request progressive taxi, and the controller will provide very specific instructions, often in chunks as you move along. Skylane 7241 Romeo, turn left on Bravo 4. Unable for Skylane 41 Romeo, I can exit at Bravo 5. Skylane 41 Romeo, roger, turn left on Bravo 5. Left on Bravo 5, Skylane 41 Romeo. If you feel that you cannot safely comply with an air traffic control instruction, reply unable and if possible, advise the controller of an alternative action that you are able to do. This will allow the controller to issue alternative instructions that will ensure a safe operation. Skylane 7241 Romeo, I have your IFR clearance to Albany. Advise ready to copy. Stand by, November 7241 Romeo. Stand by. You can also tell a controller to stand by if you can't respond right away. Being aware of the key phrases, safety terms, and words to effectively communicate with air traffic control will help pilots make better decisions and, along with the ATC tower, keep the operation safe and efficient. We hope this short video helps you for your next trip. It's always better to know before you go.